Well, tonight we have a heartbreaking update to tell you about. Do you remember the Houston man who was a teen dad and both father and son ended up seniors at the same time? One in high school, the other in law school. Well, as Fox 26's Domelik Key tells us tonight, the father has now passed a bar exam, but sadly his son has now passed away. This isn't at all the follow up story I thought I would be doing. Just days after Damon Jones passed the bar, his son was admitted into the hospital and he never came out. I pray special blessings over these, these parents, God. Pray Lord, you just touch them and cover them. And With prayer, them. balloons, and tears, loved ones have gathered to remember Devontae Jones on what would have been his 20th birthday. That's my boy. Like, like we grew up together. Like I tell you before, like we were about 15, I swear I had him. In. Devante died four days earlier of complications from lupus. His kidneys fail, his lungs. We introduced you to Damon Jones and his son last year when Devante was graduating high school and his dad was finishing law school. Quite an accomplishment for anyone, particularly Jones, who became a dad when he was 15. Kashmir High School had just started a child care program, so Damon and Devante went to school together for three years. Damon going to class, Devante attending daycare there. It all started right here at Kashmir. Yes. You guys grew up together. Yes, yes, yes. And we used to walk through this park. And we're going to miss you, Devante. So at Trinity Gardens Park is where Jones is having this balloon release, making one final fond memory with his son, who's only here in spirit this time. It's a tough day, uh, but I'm thankful to just have family and friends. We love you. We miss you. Sending purple floating messages as close to heaven as they'll go brings comfort. And just knowing that he's at peace and he's resting, and that, that's, that makes me feel good. Happy birthday to you. Although Devante didn't blow out candles and make a wish, Jones says his son wanted the two of them to own a food truck. And then he told all the nurses, like, hey, me and my dad, we got a food truck. And he dreamed of his dad having his own law firm. Jones hopes to make at least that part come true. The grieving father also plans to continue the nonprofit his son started called Bright, being righteous in God's house together, a ministry that offers scholarships and hope to the kids here in Kashmir Gardens. I'm Domalee Keith, Fox 26 News.